Hey guys, Og Zia from the US. Welcome to the channel and thank you for watching. Yeah, I tried it. I tried my best. I tried to stay away from Kai Harvard and Timo Werner today, but <laughs> I have to admit it, I couldn't. I couldn't take it anymore because we have so much going on. We have great news out there and I have to report to you guys because that is part of my job. So I broke my own rules and I'm here to report to you guys that we have great news. The first one is about Timo Werner, of course. I told you many, many days ago that Timo Werner is officially a blue and there is no doubt about it it 99.9 percent .9 done and all we are waiting for is to pay the release clause and pu put the pen on the paper and everything will be done and many sources are saying now that it's gonna be announced before uh the 15th of this month because uh that when his uh release clause will expire so we have no choice but to do it so in a few days from now you will see officially you know something out there and <laughs> some people started even making some fake videos some fake uh, twitter and instagram announcement you know uh and they they kind of make mad um fake chelsea account and say we have news for Timo Werner and la, 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 la. So yeah, it's just funny, man. That's what people do. It's Photoshop. It's not true, but hey, it's uh, it's 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 a so much fun to see what people can can do. Anyways, guys, so be happy. Don't worry, because it's happening. It's gonna happen in a few days. Who knows? Maybe by the time you watch this video, it's gonna be already announced. So, man. Timo Werner is a blue. Welcome to the best team in London. And let's start preparing to do some damage next season. All right. So the second news is about his uh, his brother, <laughs> Kai Harvard. So we have some good German connection now. Rudiger and Timo Werner. And it's going to be Kai Harvard. So I think Kai Harvard is more than ever motivated now to join the best team in london because he got already a german connection over there michael Ballack, tony rudiger timo werner you know what i mean so he's going to feel at home and he he, he won't have any problem adapting in london so according to nicolo skira who is you know one of the best in the business. He's on top there with uh, Fabrizio Romano and all the big guys. When they give you a news, it's 99% done. So he said that uh, Chelsea and Bayern are fighting now for the signature of Kai Harvard. Wow, so Bayern just uh, joined us. And the release clause is about like... I don't know 75 million something like that 71 million pound so i'm just wondering why do we have to fight with bayon if he got the release close all we have to do is just go there and make a deal just pay the money man somebody like uh, kai harvard that is cheap if you ask me you know you have such a talent with you Pay the money and don't play games because you don't want to miss out on this guy. And Bayern Munich, we all know that they don't pay much money on, on transfer fee and they, they have like some kind of salary cap and all that. So we have advantage. We have the money. We have a lot of money. We can offer him whatever he want. Not like whatever he want, but you know what I'm trying to say. So... If I was Marina right now, I would go there, pay the release clause, offer Kai Harvard a good salary, and then, you know, get it done. Get it done like now. And according to uh, what uh, 
Nicolo uh, Skira said, he said that uh, Chelsea have offered Kai Harvard five-year contract worth eight million a year. Wow, that could be maybe five, six, or maybe ten times more money than what what he was getting uh, at Bayern. So he he will be very happy. But I'm 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 just wondering if he's going to take this contract because we just offered Timo Werner uh, a bumping 10 million a year so I'm just wondering if he's not going to push to get the same money as Timo Werner but something to take to consideration is that Timo Werner is 24 he's in his prime and um and Kai Harvard is only 20 and he still has, you know, long way to go. And um, which is understandable, you know, if uh, if we give him less money than what we offered to to Timo Werner. But hey, for me, I mean, if I have to pay this guy 10 million a year, I would do it because we're going to get our money back with commercial with you know you just imagine how big uh kai harvard is going to be a couple seasons from now so we're gonna get all our money back just get him whatever he wants and bring him to the bridge so we can we can start some domination <laughs> chelsea the domination nation <laughs> so i don't know why we have to fight with uh with bayern like i said this is time to punch them seriously. We have to get the revenge for what they tried to do about Kalium Hastonadoy, you know. And uh, we already took uh, Timo Werner away from them. Remember, they wanted to sign Timo Werner last season. And this season, guess what? He's a blue. And if we can go and get Kai Harvard right from their noses, it's gonna be a sweet revenge so man i'm so excited i can't wait for next season to be already here so we can start doing some damage can you imagine ah my gosh hakim zich okay timo verna kai harvard tammy abram christian pulisic and let's throw out the Kalium Hasanadoy. I don't care what people said, but my boy is do is going to do some damage. My goodness, what a team! And probably we are going to have a better left back and another centre back in the midfield. I don't think we need anybody. That team is going to challenge for the Premier League next season. Yes, I know that uh, they need time to to jam. And it's not going to happen overnight. But we already have a code of player that can already make it easier for the newcomer to adapt easily. Because it's not like we are changing the whole team. We are just adding a lot of quality in the team. In the team that is already good. In the team that already have a philosophy. So it won't take that uh, long. To adapt and start performing so man people have been calling me that uh, I've been like Frank Lampard fans boy but the juries is going to be out there next season we are going to start judging Frank Lampard because he got what he wanted he got quality so it's time to perform and it's time to deliver and I'm sure Frank Lampard is going to deliver Anyways, guys, I, I, I can talk over and over here for two hours, but it's not important. I wanted just to make sure that you guys know what's going on in the Chelsea world and how we are going to dominate the world. Are you excited? I am. Be happy. Don't worry. Subscribe to the channel. Be cool like N'Golo Kante because he's back. And think outside the box and see you in the next one. <laughs>